We actually have Spiral making some splashes in tournaments. We have Mech Knights and really Marincess as well. This map has never looked more fun. I think 30% of you that have not smashed the ever-living crap out of that subscribe button, smash it so you guys don't miss out. More awesome content. Yeah, that's right. That is, uh, that is Spiral actually making waves down here. Now, I didn't think that we would see Spiral anytime soon, to be perfectly honest with you. But when I saw this list from Asian Persuasion, I was like, oh man, I really want to talk about this. Because you don't see this deck. Also, Double Last Resort is also kind of interesting. So, I mean, how much extender power can you actually pull off with this deck? I mean, it's still going to revolve around, you know, Machine Dupe and probably, you know, your best cards, getting the resolution of this, and then you just start link climbing up into the Tri-Gate set up here, and then you watch your opponent Kaiju you. That's, uh, that's kind of what it feels like but deck feels really really fun so we have one copy of code breaker zero day we have one dd crow with two copies of effect Baylor. we have one ghost spell we have two copies of the gizmek uh sunrise signal okay we have triple copies of Fenrir. we have one skullmeister with triple copies of drone two copies of last resort triple copies of quick fix one sleepy lad and then we have triple super agent your one tough one foolish barrel goods triple copies of the machine duplication one one for one one rota of course two copies of the small world this is actually quite an interesting little inclusion in the deck that's why you play something like this to bridge the gap we also have one big world or <laughs> big world one big red one assault triple copies of spiral resort one terraforming then we have one utility wire and one rescue then we have one trigate wizard one double helix one secure gardener one lingaribo with your one nightmare unicorn one nightmare phoenix one nightmare griffin one cerberus with your one virus swordsman one virus berserker one copy of barricade borg one Apollos, so one access code, one Princess Sprite, and then one Recital Starling. And then we have one copy of Jizakuru, one Kumamungus, two copies of Cosmic Cyclone, two Dark Roller No More, one Feather Duster, one Herald of the Abyss, two Talents, two Thrust, and then we have triple copies of Anti Unfun Spell Fragrance here, wrapping up, well, one of the more interesting lists out of the day. Next up here, Hi Mech Knights. Johnny is an absolute legend playing this deck. Let me tell you, if it's if there's ever been somebody out there that would like scare you playing this deck, it, it should actually be Asian Persuasion. Because there's so many weird interactions that you can pull off, especially you know, like the column abuse, you you go second with this deck, clean things up, and then you're like, oh yeah, by the way, so we can go ahead and do some mech knight shenanigans. The way that this deck works is actually pretty incredible at the end of the day so i will say definitely one of the more interesting things out here so we have two copies of gamma seal the little fun kaiju we have triple copies of grisu the orcus mech knight we have triple copies of mech knight blue sky with one indigo clips we have triple copies of purple nightfall one copy of red moon with one yellow star we also have one world chalice one change of heart with two dark roller no more one feather duster Two Lightning Storms with one copy of Mind Control. Your Triple Pot of Prosperity. Then we have two Talents, one Thrust, one copy of the Key, one Succession. Your Triple Memory, triple copies of Evenly Matched. Your one Whispers and your triple copies of Secret. Then we have one Underworld Goddess, one Al Mirage with your one Spectrum Supreme. We have two Morning Star, yeah, two Morning Star, one Avermax, your one Lingaribo, your one Ling Spider, your Triple Lib, one copy of Galtea, one Axis Machine, one Zeus, and one Lingarisu. Hmm, yeah. Uh-huh. This card is involved in so many unfun things at this point in time. I'm not surprised anymore. So we have triple copies of Nightmare Corrupt Ribley, triple copies of Space Rock, triple copies of Anti-Spell Fragrance, triple Dimensional Bear, and, of course, triple copies of Summon Limit here. Wrapping up, well, one of the more interesting little things that we've uh, seen out there. I uh, I like what we're seeing here, that's for sure. So, uh, Mech Knights, everybody, I, I like that. Next up here we have Marincess sporting off Ice Jade Ran a Green here. Uh, this is the one that makes, you know, access to these big synchros here that allow you, you know, control options against your opponent. It's actually very interesting to see, like, the power that you can kind of bring to the table, you know, just because these are literally, you know, free because of this card. Well, I mean, as free as a, you know, discard card from your hand, but it's fine. So we have one copy of the Adarla, the June Moon. That's actually interesting to see. It's also another relatively large water monster that you can just plop onto the field. Okay. We have two copies of Ash Blossom and Joy Spring. We have one Barrier Statue of the Torrent. Two copies of Droll Knockbird with two Sea Turtles. We have triple copies of Ice G. 
Jade uh, Grind. Triple copies of the Blue Tang with one copy Mandarin. Two Pascalis, triple copies of Marinsa Seahorse. And we have triple copies of Sprint Girl here. Then we have one called by the Gray. Triple copies of Cross Out Dozen here. One Foolish Burrow with one Feather Duster. We have two Battle Oceans with two copies of Dive. We also have one Monster Reborn. Two Talents, triple Imperm. Two Wave. And we're actually seeing double White Howling here in the main deck. Yeah, well, negating all spells your opponent's field is pretty good for a whole turn. We also have one Zelantis, two Sea Angel, one Marbled Rock, one Bubble Reef, one Crystal Heart, one Coral Triangle with two copies of Coral Animone, two copies of Blue Slug, one Aqua Argonaut, one Eria, and then we have one Chinging and one copy of a Grind. And then, of course, two Chaos Hunters. We have one Droll Knockbird, two Space Rock, two Cosmic Cyclone, two Lightning Storm, triple evenly matched, and triple copies of Gozen Match here. Wrapping up some more particulars out here for the format. I, I didn't think that we would see Marincess actually kind of do something. So this is this is interesting to me at the end of the day. Next up here, <sighs> you know, that's ninjas. That that is ninjas. To be honest with you, ninjas are one of the... People don't know how to play against this deck, obviously. This goes into the Vanquish Soul category of, oops, something happened here. Uh, so, right, let's just dig into this. So we have two copies of Ash Blossom and Joy Spring. We have one copy of Baku, the Beast Ninja. Triple copies of Droll Knockbird. We have one copy of Green Ninja. Interesting, because so many ninja players told me that this is a two of. Uh, we have one copy of Geo. One copy of Kagro, triple copies of Fenrir. We also have triple copies of Mitsu the Insect Ninja, triple copies of Nibiru, triple copies of Hanzo the Best in Ninja, and then we have triple copies of Tobari. Remember, no upstart ninja. You don't have a lot of traps to be able to discard. You know, that was the thing that made that card decent was, you know, you had enough fodder to usually make it worthwhile. Uh, not this time. Uh, we also have triple copies of Book of Moon, one called by the group. One Feather Duster, one Instant Infusion, triple copies of uh, Notebook of Mystery. We have one copy of the Equip, one Rada, one Talent, triple copies of Dancing Leaves, and one Art of Duplication. And we, have, of course, we have two Sizo. We have one copy of Dahark. We have two copies of Cross Sheep, one Boral Sword, one Sprite, one Zeus. Then we have triple copies of Yagamaru, one giant ultimate great insect, and triple copies of Mizen. Then we have triple copies of Gadarla, triple Cosmic Cyclone, triple copies of Anti Spell Fragrance, triple copies of Dimensional Bear, and triple copies of There Can Only Be One Here, wrapping off. Actually, one of the more interesting little anti-meta decks that you can have out here. If you want some free wins, honestly, Ninja might be the way to go about it. Because, once again, so many people don't know how this deck works. And the fact that you're able to kind of play these extremely weird decks and catch your opponent off guard is why you'll win. Alright, next up. Oh, boy. Man, I'm back again with Super Heavy Samurai Sword. So, let me tell you. I've seen this deck a couple of times. And... You know, the, the more I, I, I see this, the more I'm just like, it, it it gets more and more interesting to me that this combination of things is able to actually work. So, I mean, the, the scales are busted. That's the thing that makes them good. So we have triple copies of Ash, Blossom, and Joy Spring. We have two copies of Jerusalem. Triple copies of Magna Hut with one copy of Distrudo. We also have triple copies of Ecclesia. We have one copy of Ring of Worm with one copy of Big Banky. You got the triple motorbike near triple Wakashi. Your one Soul Gaia booster with your triple Moi. Two copies of Tai with triple copies of Long Yun. And then we have two copies of Ara Ara. Triple copies of Ashuna. Triple copies of Vishuda. And then, of course, triple Emergence. One Summit and one Blackout. Then we have two Monks. One copy of Yazi. One Cheng Ying. Your one Quing Zing Long Yun. Two Chi One Punisher. One Draco Berserker. Your one Black Rose. Two copies of Boxia. One Baron. One Dragite. And one Excel Synchro. Then, of course, Triple Droll, two Little Nibirus, two Swaj de Filor, one Feather Duster, two Talents, two Anti-Scam, and triple copies of Summon Limit here. Wrapping up some of the most interesting little good stuff to kind of come out here in terms of the metagame. So, uh, what do you guys think about everything out here? Because there's a lot to really unfold here. And I think that's, uh, that's what's making this format very interesting. So please, leave a comment down below to my thing, and I will see your beautiful faces back here later in the day, guys. Peace. Patrons!
Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other videos.